So I've come on here to talk to my good sisters in Christ, okay, about a problem that we have. And that problem is fantasies. Now, to be fair, I feel like most women, not just Christian women, deal with this issue, and some men as well. But fantasies. Guys, God convicted me and my friend a couple of months ago um, regarding our fantasies and regarding fantasizing about boys. And if you'll be honest, as a girl, you've had one of those days where you just go to bed and you can't wait to start coming up with scenarios in your mind about this guy that you like or like you're just walking along and you having you're you're coming up with fantasies and scenarios about you know random guys that you find attractive and it's so dangerous because the bible says that we need to guard our hearts and when you're fantasizing about somebody that you don't actually know you are creating a whole personality a whole other being in your mind and you're falling in love with that fantasy but the real person isn't like your fantasy not only that, but you continuously fantasizing about the opposite sex can lead to idolatry. There are people in this world that very much worship romantic love, worship the opposite sex, though they may not know it. But you know that you're in idolatry or very dangerously close to idolatry when that's literally all you can think about. You spend most of your time thinking about the opposite sex or thinking about being in a relationship or marriage or whatever. And that's very dangerous. Because if that has the throne of your heart, that means you've pushed Jesus to the side and he no longer has the throne of your heart. And now you're into idolatry. You are now worshiping romantic love, the idea of romantic love, um, the idea of a guy. And you know you have this problem when you can literally fantasize about anybody. Like you just walk out the street and you, you see somebody that's attractive and you just start creating these scenarios in your mind. First of all, it's not helpful. Guard your heart. The Bible says don't awaken love before it's time. Don't break your own heart by fantasizing about somebody that doesn't even know you exist. Or about somebody that, you know, you've created a whole other personality and that's not how they are. Not only is it idolatry, but it leads to disappointment and hurt. So guys, cast down imaginations. Whenever you feel yourself start to fantasize about something you shouldn't be thinking about, cast down imaginations. There's a verse in the Bible that says this specifically. And what I like to do is I say, I cast down every imagination that exalts itself against the knowledge of God and take every thought captive to the obedience of Christ. And when I say that, it works. I no longer think about that thing. It may take you having to cast down imaginations multiple times before you actually stop. But pray about this and ask God to deliver you from the spirit of idolatry, from fantasies, so that you can live in the real world. God bless you guys.